Our volunteers are really, really skilled, enthusiastic people, but a lot of them also come on site not having skills that they then leave with. Originally I volunteered for experience in the festival and kind of arts industry. Um, it paired up alongside a master's degree that I'm doing um, and allowed me to study the festival for one of my modules, write an essay on it and then come and see it and work in practice. So we're not necessarily looking for people who are essentially like really trained in a specific thing. We're looking for people who really love what we do, understand how important it is to us and to our families and to get stuck in with that really. I think I enjoy feeling like you're part of a whole group of people who are working to put something together and being behind the scenes because it's really great to go to a festival and see all the acts and stuff but it's like a whole nother awesome experience to be the person who's providing that entertainment for people. We're all kind of like nice and friendly and like it's quite apprehensive like oh I'm not going to know anyone in Migro it makes friends but like it's just been very easy and very laid back so it's been nice. Most festivals are geared towards kind of 20 somethings drinking lots of alcohol and all that kind of stuff. There's not a lot of stuff for families to do together that's really interesting and it seemed like a great way to support that and do something that our son should enjoy. You can have a range of experiences. If you're a design volunteer, you can be using Brief to create different designs, visually for different areas, different art installations. If you're looking for logistics, we have a lot of logistical stewarding, ticketing, wristbanding, um, but then also more production site assistants. I have a team under me who are all mini uh, production site assistants who are Glade managers. Uh, I'm a Glade assistant slash manager kind of thing so I manage uh, a certain area which is head over heels and make sure that all of the artists there are like really like happy and making sure that they're really like, comfortable with what they're doing and making sure the audience is fine. I'm going to be looking after the performers when they come down and um, making sure the audience is having a good time and hanging out with the pirates at the shipwreck. Well, we're in charge of the uh, 0-4s area, it's called Peekaboo, um, so that's got all the uh, baby bath time and uh, nappy changing facilities. There's not really been a hierarchy here, like whether you're the festival director or you're just helping out, everyone's sort of just like together. I am part of the design team and I made the lion um, for the head over heels area. We get to be in charge of like the overall design look of the area. The thing I enjoy the most about the volunteer experience is the lovely team atmosphere, working with lots of nice creative people, building stuff together and just having a good time. It's very inspiring. I want to, everything I've made, I'm like, oh, I want to go home and make that. I want a cloud in my bedroom or I want bunting everywhere. It's just a really nice atmosphere. Uh, there's, I guess there's some kind of pressure and stress to get stuff done, but it's pretty laid back and uh, it's just generally, a, yeah, just generally a relaxed place to be doing interesting stuff. Here it's just, you know, you're, what you do, we feel like it matters. And all the people here are so much fun, we've made really good friends and we just hang out a lot and, it's, and work very hard. If you've got a love for literature, there's like a literature tent so you can go and like do loads of stuff with books or if you just like the outdoors, there's loads of stuff to do outdoors. It's amazing to watch a field be transformed into this kind of wonderland. Two strings of bunting make a path that you feel is leading you somewhere where previously it was just a bit of woodland that had no direction to it at all. Our families meet our volunteers on a daily basis. They're the first faces they see, the last ones they see when they leave. They are the ones that completely drive the experience that the families have at the festival. 